Hello, hello, welcome back to my channel. My name is Amelie if you're new here, and I have such a fun vlog coming up for you guys. I'm so excited to be sharing this weekend. I'm starting this vlog a little bit later in the day. It is around 2 p.m. I started my day with some movement. I went on a three mile run, and then I had a school bake sale, which is why I didn't really pick up the camera. But now it is time to officially get this vlog and day started. I'm on the way to a hair appointment. I'm just doing like a quick little trim to freshen up for my birthday. And then after that, I'm celebrating my birthday with Grant, and we have like a little beach date planned I'm not exactly sure what we're gonna do but he's planning like a little sunset date for us so that's gonna be really nice if you guys are new here or don't know Grant is my boyfriend but he lives in Santa Barbara because he goes to college there and he's actually home for the weekend which is so nice so I'm gonna celebrate with him because he actually leaves on my birthday so we're celebrating a little bit early and then the celebrations just continue because tonight I'm celebrating with the rest of my friends and me and my friend Dom are doing a little joint birthday party because my birthday Day is on Monday the 12th and then his is literally on Valentine's Day which is Wednesday so two days after mine so we're celebrating with all of our friends together so that's gonna be tonight and then tomorrow is the Super Bowl so of course there's gonna be like watch parties for that and then my actual birthday is on Monday so with that welcome to today's vlog we have lots of celebrating it's gonna be so much fun and I'm just so happy that I can share this special birthday with you guys because turning 18 is like insane like I have been really excited for this birthday for a really long time for just so many reasons like I feel like it's like a step into adulthood and moving out and going to college but also it's just like insane to me that I'm not gonna be a minor anymore I'm not gonna be a little baby it's crazy I don't know I just feel like childhood and high school it's all kind of ending and this is just like one step closer to that and it's just insane so I'm excited I'm a little nervous I'm a little sad but mostly excited anyways I could talk about turning 18 for so long but I have a hair appointment to go to so I'll pick up the camera once our hair is all done okay haircut is done you guys I'm obsessed I asked her to keep as much length as possible and, and then I just also asked her to like define my layers a little bit more and refresh my curtain bangs and then I also asked her to curl my hair just so it was like out of the way which is perfect because Grant just texted me to be ready to go on our little sunset date in 20 minutes and I'm 10 minutes from home and I still have to do my makeup and change so thank God my hair is taken care of but yeah, as I was saying, this weekend is packed and because Grant leaves on Monday, which is actually my birthday, and we're celebrating Valentine's Day and my birthday all in one weekend today is the day that we're going on like a little date and he is planning a little sunset trip i'm gonna run home get ready as quickly as possible and then i'll pick up the camera when we are on the way to sunset makeup is complete i just did a little quick refresh this is the outfit i picked out it's very fall vibes but i literally was so indecisive i couldn't figure out what to wear so we're just gonna go with the brown theme but really quick i just wanted to show you guys the reality of being a teenage girl and honestly just a human look at my room right now I have so many boxes that need to be unpacked and put away. My desk is a mess. I was just getting ready. Clothes all over my bed because I couldn't figure out what to wear. Like literally dirty laundry everywhere. My room has definitely seen better days, but that's okay. I just got back from a trip. My room is never clean when I'm getting ready, so that's another reason. But I just wanted to show you guys that I am not always organized. And what can I say? I'm just a teenage girl. But anyways, we're all ready. Grant is texting me. I kind of took a little bit too long to get ready, so sorry about that. It is 4 p.m. The sun sets at 5.30. He's about to pick me up. We're going to go to the store, get some little picnic items, and then we're going to go watch the sunset. And I'm so excited. I 
I just finished getting ready. We were back from sunset. You guys, that date was perfect. It was literally one of the most beautiful sunsets I've ever seen in my area. We got sushi, just sat, listened to music. It was honestly so nice. And even though it's early, the best way to celebrate my birthday. Now I'm all ready to continue the party. Ignore the dirty mirror and the weird lighting, but I'm wearing this white bodysuit from Princess Polly, these black Levi jeans, and then I have these black and white striped Converse that I'm gonna wear. This is the birthday outfit. The cake and candles are downstairs. We're about to go leave to pick up Grant. And I'm so excited to celebrate with all of my friends. Yeah, you taste like Good morning, you guys. Happy Sunday. It is the next morning around 11 a.m. Last night was so fun. I went to bed so freaking late. I think I went to sleep around like two or three. So today I just let myself sleep in, have a really slow morning. Now we are awake, we are energized, and it is time to move my body because with so much celebration this weekend and just all of the yummy foods, which you guys know, balances everything. Memories over macros always. Like I will never say no to cake, especially on my birthday. I just know that I'm gonna feel like my best self when I move my body. So it is 11 a.m. I'm all ready for the gym. My top is from Crop Shop Boutique. These shorts are from Amazon. The brand is Arola and they're so flattering. I just filled up my water. I have some electrolytes in it from Peak Life. It is supposed to help with youthful skin and deep hydration. So we definitely need some of that today. My split has been all messed up this entire week because I was in Santa Barbara earlier and I've really just been trying to listen to my body this week just because there's like so much going on. So even though I did a cardio run yesterday, I'm probably just gonna go do some more cardio today, some abs, and then I'm just gonna restart a new split tomorrow. So that's the plan for this morning. I have a few errands that I have to run. I'm probably gonna go to the mall and then later today at three o'clock we have a super bowl party so i'm super excited it should be a fun day but movement first always because it just sets me up for success workout is complete i ended up running three miles on the treadmill and then i did some pull-ups and called it a day and then i got all ready we're wearing red obviously go niners it's the super bowl now i'm gonna go get some coffee and head to the mall i want to get my eyebrows threaded i'm gonna try to find grant a little valentine's day gift and then maybe do some shopping for myself i'm not really sure it's one o'clock and my super bowl party starts at three so we're on a little bit of a time crunch because it's about like a 15 minute drive to get to the mall so we're gonna have to be speedy with it i also want to get some coffee you guys I am like overheating right now in my car it was literally pouring rain two days ago and now California has just done a full 180 it's sunny and like low-key starting to get warm so I'm really hot right now I also forgot all of my jewelry 
But that reminds me that you guys can use code AmelieDesai for 20% off every jewels. And that is where I get all of my jewelry and I always get questions about it. So I just thought I would mention that. But I had a really good workout. It felt really good to move and I'm excited to now get this day started because we got things to do, places to be. It is a great Sunday and my last day being 17, which is literally insane. But anyways, let's go get some coffee and do some shopping. Guys, the coffee is coffeeing today and that's how you know it's gonna be a great day. Okay, super quick haul. I went to the mall and then they didn't have what I wanted to get Grant, so I had to go to REI, so we're running a little bit late. But I ended up getting Grant this black Stanley because he does not drink, because he definitely does not drink enough water and he always drinks out of mine. So hopefully now he can have his own one. We got a little black and white moment. I was kind of in between on these because I've seen a lot of guys have them. But then at the same time, I know that it's more of like a girly thing. But you know what? No toxic masculinity here. Everyone deserves to be hydrated and I feel like he's gonna like this. And then I accidentally did some damage at the mall for myself. But you know what? I'm just gonna call it a little early birthday gift to myself because one of my goals for 18 is to really revamp my closet and like really just get rid of everything that I don't wear. So out with the old, in with the new. Happy birthday to me. I got myself these they're like green brown and they're like these really baggy low-rise levi jeans so this was definitely an investment in myself and style but i'm really really excited about them and that just tells me that it was worth it because i feel like when you buy something and you just like can't stop thinking about it and you're excited to wear it it's a sign that it was worth the money very successful haul it is now three 16 the Super Bowl party started at 3 but the Super Bowl itself doesn't actually start until 3 30 So I should get there just in time. I have two today So Grant's family has like an annual Super Bowl party and that starts at 3 and then one of our friends is also throwing a Super Bowl party So I think we're gonna do like half half so that way we can go to both after that I don't really know what the plan is I'm gonna give Grant his gift today for Valentine's Day So that should be really fun and then today's my last day with Grant because he leaves tomorrow So we're just gonna like hang out and and have fun together and it's just been a really fun weekend so far and I'm just feeling really really excited to be 18 and have a new birthday and honestly to me birthdays are kind of like New Year's and honestly a little bit bigger because it's so individual like on New Year's everyone is having a new year but on your birthday it's like a little reset for yourself so I'm definitely gonna do like some journaling and stuff like that tonight but that's for later it's time to go to the Super Bowl party Good morning! I'm so sorry we're on my phone because I totally forgot to film. I was rushing around getting ready this morning, but you guys, uh, I'm 18. I'm legally an adult, which is literally insane to say. We made it! I'm in my school parking lot. I'm already running late to school, so what a great way to start adulthood. This is my outfit. My top is from Addicted, and these jeans are from Levi's. I'll show you guys better, but I just wanted to say good morning. I didn't work out today because I just wanted to spend time getting ready, and I also just wanted to sleep in because, you know what? This year is all about getting enough sleep. So I'll probably work out later today. I just want to pick up the camera, say good morning, and I'll talk to you guys later today because we're running very late to school. Guys, Ofek brought me a birthday cupcake. No, he didn't. He kind of did. What? He kind of did. He, did. he did not bring you that. He offered it after you brought it up, but let's be no, very clear. This was not his heart. <laughs> Car 
right now. I just went and got lunch with my friends. We went to this burrito place. It was so good. I ate pretty much that whole thing and I am so full. But I was really craving a sweet treat and all of my other friends had things to do. But I really just wanted some frozen yogurt. So I treated myself to some frozen yogurt. My eyes may have been a little bigger than my stomach, but... Mmm exactly what i needed and this is your sign you guys memories over macros your birthday is one day it does not matter how much you're eating and it doesn't even have to be your birthday like literally any day celebrate life your body is not a calculator it is all about consistency not perfection and honestly my life would not be enjoyable without ice cream and burritos so i'm gonna have my ice cream and burritos and enjoy every second of it and also, you don't need to be with people to treat yourself. You can eat food alone because your body deserves food. No matter who you're with, no matter the time of day, you can go get ice cream alone because it's fun. And delicious. But so far, I'm having an amazing birthday. I just wanted to show you guys my ice cream, update you guys on my day because I forgot my camera, so I haven't really been vlogging. But I'm gonna go home, take a quick little power nap, and then I'm actually gonna go see the sunset with some of my friends. Grant just left today, which is really sad, and so I'm gonna spend my birthday with some more of my friends, and I'm really excited for that. So I'm gonna finish eating this, and then I'll see you guys in a little bit when we go see the sunset. Looked in your eyes, they're burning like cigarettes on top of a head They could resurrect a Lazarus up from a grave that somehow made you cry Hi guys, I just got back from the beach. I just want to say I'm so sorry. I was a terrible vlogger today, but honestly I was just working on being really present with my friends and just enjoying my birthday and I honestly could not have asked for a better birthday. School was so much fun. I got so many amazing birthday wishes. Then you guys saw I went out to lunch with a few of my friends. I got an amazing burrito. Then I went to ice cream myself. And then a few of my other friends and I decided to go to the sunset just to celebrate even more. And we ended up going to McDonald's and I got a McFlurry and some french fries. And it was honestly just the perfect 18th. I got to celebrate with Grant earlier this weekend, all of my other friends, and I just felt so loved and celebrated. And also thank you guys so much. I have gotten so many of the sweetest messages ever. I'm trying to respond to all of them as many as I can, but I just feel so loved. And I just want to say I love you guys and it just means so much to me. And I'm just so excited to share whatever 18 holds with you guys because I'm so excited for this new year and this new era of adulthood, which is like insane to say. Before I end off today's vlog, I just wanted to talk about celebrating and how okay it is. I have no makeup on. My skin is breaking out. My room is a mess. I honestly don't feel that good. My stomach kind of hurts from all of the foods that I'm not used to eating and I just haven't really been taking care of my nutrition over the past week because I've been celebrating so much and I don't regret any of it. I would not change the way that I've acted the past week for anything because I have shared so many amazing memories with so many amazing people celebrating this life and just having so much fun. Which again is why I always say memories over macros. You have your entire life ahead of you to chase your fitness goals and feel good and eat right, whatever you want to call it. But moments like these, birthdays, celebrating your loved ones, like that only happens once. So it's okay to have a stomach ache after eating ice cream even though you know you probably shouldn't because it makes your stomach hurt. And it's okay to have a super messy room and go to bed at 2 a.m. like I did the other night because you only live once and it's so important to have that balance in your lifestyle because that's what lets you not only appreciate the days that you do feel amazing and your skin is clear and you go to sleep on time and you pop right out of bed, but it also just shows you that you're doing it out of a choice and not because you feel like you have to and it lets you do it for longer because you don't feel restricted. You feel like you're choosing it and you love it and that's what makes you happy. And just like working out and waking up at 5 a.m. and eating yummy salads makes me happy, make flurries and going to sleep at 2 a.m. also make me happy. So I just could not have thought of a better way to spend my birthday. And I'm so excited and I'm feeling so loved and grateful and a little bit sick to my stomach, I will not lie. That burrito and ice cream and french fries is not really sitting with me. 
But you know what I'm gonna do tomorrow? I'm gonna get back on track. We're gonna wake up at five. We're gonna have an amazing workout and I'm gonna get my nutrition right back on track and it's all gonna be fine. And I'm gonna have all of these fun, amazing memories behind me. So treat your body with love and respect. It's okay to get off of track. Celebrate your life. Don't stress over the little things because memories are so much more important than what your body looks like, how your stomach feels, if you have a pimple here and there, like, it's okay. That's part of life. Anyways, make sure you guys are following all of my other social media platforms because I post daily. It's the best way to stay connected and this way we can share 18 together. I love you guys so much. Like and subscribe because it helps me more than you know. And I'll see you in the next one. Both of your hands were rough like a carpenter's So accustomed to nails and to hammers Never with files, nails would cut inside